What's up, ladies and gentlemen? My name's Seth, and we are back here for another Lego World. I've been messing around with a lot of the stuff behind the scenes, as you can plainly tell, because we are finally Skeleton Man. So this game is very, very glitchy and weird. Uh, I guess that's why it's early access, but most of the Lego games kind of are always very, very buggy, just in general, so I don't expect some of these things to be resolved by the time the game is out, because most of it is just kind of a design choice. Anyway, uh, I found out in order to actually play as these other characters, you just go into this character menu, and then you click on them, and then it just transforms you into them instantly. Another thing, too, I found out while I was just randomly building is you see how far the camera zoomed out? If we actually zoom in or out while we're in build mode, the camera kind of stays in that position. So that's good or bad, I don't know. But the cool thing about these characters is this guy, at least, has a special ability. And he screams into the camera. It's very, very cool. Uh, also, I ended up turning off the music because I found that this game has some pretty horrible mixing. Uh, especially when we're building stuff, that's like the loudest thing that you actually run into in the game. So I turned off the music so that I could turn it on myself. Ooh, is it on again? No, okay, I gotta keep double checking because the settings don't save properly. But anyway, I just kind of put like nor other music just overlaying underneath it. Now anyway, over here I was trying to construct like a castle in the mountain. Didn't quite turn out as I was kind of learning the build mechanics and stuff like that. You can kind of see all the chunks that have been taken out of that mountain. Because it spirals its way up to the tippy top where there's that beautiful thing. But as for today, I don't know what we're going to do. You know what? We've never, we've yet to explore the ocean, and I still see a couple things under in the water that we haven't actually explored yet. We saw these last time, so I want to go check these out and see if these are actually something, or if the water is pretty much pointless. I know there is, like, uh, boats and stuff like that, so it definitely doesn't mean that there's not something we could come across. We're just kind of running into a little bit of an issue here, though, and it doesn't actually look like anything is actually underwater unfortunately i do see a spider but i think that's underground and we're not gonna have any way of digging our way into the underwater biome or anything like that or digging into the dirt i don't know if this game has like proper water physics or anything like that but hey whatever we'll have to figure it out there finally we ended up getting ourselves up on the surface of the water because otherwise we were running into a lot of trouble where i couldn't actually do it do we have these mushrooms no we don't even have this biome is that a skeleton over there? My goodness. By the way, the whole, like, thing... Ooh! Okay. What is this gonna be? What'd we get? What is it? Please show me. A bow and arrow! <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, well, anyway, the other thing, too, is this guy's screech ability. I don't know if it works on these guys. No, it doesn't. So, normally, we actually were able to scare, like, other wildlife and stuff like that, so that's pretty cool. Also, it seems like as we are transformed into the skeleton, these dudes are not chasing us. I see another chest over there, so we're definitely gonna go check it out. I think, anyway. Maybe it degenerated. But either way, very, very cool. I love the fact that this game actually has little details like that. I was not trying to attack him! No! No! These skeletons are scaring me! And they're making all sorts of noises! This guy is not a very good fighter, man. My goodness gracious, is he not? Alright. I guess that means we gotta turn to another character. No. Guess that means we gotta turn to another character, yeah. <laughs> so let's see, what is this Minotaur guy? Does he have anything or is he just a normal dude? Yeah, I think he's just a normal dude, so whatever. Let's just stay as him because he's big enough. He can beat things up. He's probably very, very strong or something like that. We could probably get ourselves a vehicle right now. Uh, these waypoints that kind of seem to generate around as well. For the most part, that looks like some kind of weird mushroom dungeon thing. Or is it just a mushroom biome? It looks very, very cool though, either way. But it's kind of like... I don't. I lost my train of thought. Vehicles, yes. We could spawn one, but the menus I find very, very clunky. Mushroom forest. Oh, so it's even a new biome. That's very cool. I wish it wasn't night so much in this game. Hello, Mr. Piggy! Mr. Piggy! Mr. Piggy! Yes! We are the pig rider! <laughs> Come on, Jabias! Let's get out of here! Yes, I'm a sophisticated monster on a pig! 
This is like a weird Saturday morning cartoon duo where... Okay, that pig is making some freaky noises. I'm getting off of him. But it's like some weird duo. Bull and pig. Bull and pal. I, I don't know. Where is... Ooh! I don't know what that is. Are those like meteors or are those just giant mushrooms? Either way, you know what I want to do? I want to get the camera zoomed out a little bit so we can get ourselves a beautiful screenshot of all of this awesome, awesome mushroomness. Can you get up there, Buster? There you go. Haha! -ha. Is this even working? This game's got like such horrible color contrasting. You can't see the difference between anything in the background or not. Where is... No. This way. Yes. I gotta bring that camera back in. So, I'm actually noticing there is a couple more mounts up to our north. I don't know if that is just a normal sheepy sheepy or something else. There's a spider underneath. Oh, here, there's a spider. <laughs> Why was it doing that? What is this thing? Can we do anything with it or is it just a weird prop item? Hello, Mrs. Scientist. What are you and what do you do? I don't know. I wish there was a way to turn up the sensitivity on the camera, but it doesn't seem like you can. There's a weird llama and stuff on the surface, so I definitely want to go and get those things. But I don't want to ride that stupid pig, he's too noisy. Whatever, let's do it, I'll just turn my own personal volume down. Okay, he's stuck. Never mind, leave him there to turn into bacon. Delicious bacon. Where, where's, um, whoa. There, there's the llama. I want to go get that thing. That's the other thing, which I have mentioned before, but is very, very cool about this game. I love how it doesn't take very long to travel anywhere. Ah, yes! I am the sheep rider. Baby sheep! Yeah! Yeah, mule! Oh my goodness gracious, this thing is slow. <laughs> it's funny, though. I do like this baby sheep. Ah. Can't put me to sleep. One sheep, two sheep. You should count them to go to sleep. Come here, you stupid caveman. Come back here. I may not have your club, so I can't ally you, but that doesn't mean that I won't shoot you where you stand, Buster. There. Oh. There we go. Take this. Yes, die. There we go. We needed that extra heart anyway. He's kind of gone forever, isn't he? So, these waypoints. That's why I was saying a while ago. The waypoints, uh, I think they kind of seem to generate on their own. Like, sometimes they seem to generate based on your spawn point. Other ones generate based on, like, when you come into the game or when it's, like, you can actually fight off of your horse. That's very cool. Yeah, that's actually really, really cool. But, yeah, so, anyway, they spawn kind of all over the place. There's a chest right there, thank goodness. So, they spawn on these red mushrooms. Okay. And... I think they kind of start a waypoint every time you start uh, building and stuff like that. A telescope. What is that for? I want to see. Where is that? Items. Bow and arrow. That's very, very cool. Let's see. <gasps> okay, so as it's equipped, there's actually abilities tied to some of these weapons and stuff. So that's actually very, very cool. I do want to check it out, but I'm pretty sure we got to get like up top somewhere that we can actually see what's going on. I see a canyon. I want to go to that canyon. B! 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 Can we zoom in or anything, or is this just it? I guess that's it. Ha! Huh. Well, it's cool, but it's pretty useless. That's another thing that is kind of missing from this game right now, is there doesn't seem to be any, like, pre-made structures or anything like that. I do still want to keep going around and collecting stuff, because what we do want to get our hands on is some houses and stuff like that. Is this the chick? She wants the rifle, that's right. We got the bow and arrow too though, so that means we can recruit somebody. But here's that Cowboy Jack. Come here, Cowboy Jack, I got your gun. And I wasn't able to recruit you yet. You're a bad guy? All right, take this, you weirdo, take that. Outlaw, male, all right. Whatever, I like how we got a bow and arrow, but we just beat him up with it. Whatever, that's pretty funny. Hello, Mr. Wolf. What do you want? A bone. We don't have a bone yet, I don't think. So this must be the normal guy. Yeah, he wants the gun. Ha ha! Hey, Mr. Cowboy, will you be recruited? There we go. Let's transform into him. My goodness. Okay, you know what? I like the outlaw best. He's cool. Yeah, look at him. Look at him. Ha ha! I am George. 
Hey, is that some kind of an ice biome over there or is that just more? Yeah, that's just the ocean. Okay, we may have actually even been over here already. If this is the spot that I think it is where we ended up coming. No, 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 we haven't been here. So that's cool that they have new stuff all over the place. Oh, this guy is cool. He actually, he's like Red Dead Redemption. He can call a horse. <laughs> I like the enemies in this game. They're always really, really good. Oh, thank goodness. Water that is just like light water. So that means you can actually generate and build stuff like that. So that's really, really cool. What is this up here? Is this a new biome or is this just the same one? It looks like it's just the same. I wish it wasn't like this game definitely could stand to have some better contrasting, couldn't it? <laughs> I mean, I kind of do all that post like when I'm editing the video, I kind of put a bit of effects on the video uh, to make the game a little bit more attractive and appealing. But the game itself could definitely stand to have like more color because it's a bit too gray for my taste, especially I guess it is Lego blocks, though. Hello, Mr. Horse. Where's the cave woman? She probably wants the club as well, so you know what? Forget it. I know there's airplanes in this game, too. I don't know if we're ever going to stumble upon those. This water over there actually looks like it might even be the edge of the world. This world is pretty empty. This biome, anyway. I, I don't know if there's anything in it. At all. <laughs> Whatever. We're just, we're just a wayward wanderer. We are exploring the outskirts of the world and searching for any type of treasure that we can find. Any treasure at all. Anything. Is there a way to zoom our map in? Oh, there's a house. That usually ends up having some decent loot, so let's go and do that. Yes, please. I think another thing too, I just want to double check this. Uh, I'm pretty sure when you discover a new biome, it gives you access to a bunch of special props. Or do you have to touch them and destroy them somehow? Oh, get away from me, you stupid skeleton. I, I'm, I was more looking for the gigantic mushrooms that we ended up stumbling upon. But I'm not exactly sure if those are anywhere. <laughs> Give me the treasure chest. Beautifulness. More treasure. Because we need as much money as we can get. I still want to get our hands on a wizard and stuff like that. If there was knights, that would be very cool as well. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Yes. There's so much treasure in these houses. I think there's... <gasps> we got the eggs! So that means we can finally get our hands on the beautiful... What does this actually do? We can get our hands on the wizard. So that's very, very cool. Does this prop item actually do anything? No! I want the egg! <laughs> there we go. Okay, it's a melee weapon. That's kind of weird. Take this, you stupid skeleton! I'll hit you with the egg! Eat some of this! My goodness gracious, these skeletons. Shrieking skeletons. Now, I don't know if this character necessarily has, like, better jump or something like that. She kind of has some very weird clothes. Like, they definitely generate with some very weird effects on them. Can we get into this house? You know what? Before we call it a day, let's see if we can kind of destroy our way into here. Oh, we already got it. Okay, so this house is not nearly as big as I thought it was. Huh. All right. Well, either way, get get off of there, please. There you go. Wee! I don't know what's happening, but we are the girl now. <laughs> Woo! I like jumping. I know we. I know I said we were calling the episode right then, but hey, whatever. Let's go a little bit further, just because we finally got our hands on a vehicle. A, br a really crappy one, but at least it works. Woo! My goodness, bro! No! Oh, get out of the way, you stupid came in. <laughs> Watch out, you Neanderthal freak. Wow. You know what? I bet you anything. Whee! I bet you we got to get, like, all those airplanes and stuff I was mentioning. Get out of the way. Up in the sky somehow. This world is not generating in fast enough. I would love to. <gasps> what is this? Is that just a normal pyramid? Oh, we're in a desert. Oh, thank goodness, because we haven't found a normal desert like this in quite some time. Camel! Camel! Hello, Mr. Spitty! I, I want to go into this pyramid before we end up calling the episode. I see another motorcycle as well. Where is the entrance to this place? We'll make our own entrance. There's a drill vehicle right here. All right. Excuse me. Let's dig our way in. Yes! Can you do it? Oh, jeez. 
Let's pretend that that worked. I hope it worked. Get in there, please. Get in. Okay, don't get in. Get off. Let go. There you go. I'm trying to get in here. I'm trying to eat lunch here. Man alive, this game has got some very weird stuff in here. Let's bring this up. I gotta be very careful because you don't want to delete the chest that is right up there. Let's do this. Move our camera over there. Woo! All right, beautifulness. Let's see what we got. Anything special? Get out of here, you stupid skeleton. What is this? Anything? Something good? Bazooka? I hope. Oh, we got the club. All right, so at least we can go and recruit those stupid cavemen. And speaking of which, there is one right beside us. I want to get her right now just before we call the episode. Yes? No, that's an archaeologist, I think. Why does it keep... Oh, it's a throwing weapon. Okay, that's what's going on with these stupid little dragon eggs. So they're still pretty useless, though. My goodness. You're not... You're not the person I thought you were. Get out of here. I thought you were the caveman. Well, anyway, you know what? We are going to call it here. Camel. Get on the camel. We're going to call it here for this week's episode, ladies and gentlemen. So thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to smack that like button, share favorite, and subscribe to join Team Pixel. Sign on. Stay epic, everybody. Please.